Hello, middle school families. We want to welcome you to the start of middle school with distance learning. This video is going to explain to you and your child how to log in to find their classes on the first day that we go back, August 10th. During registration week, your child received a district Chromebook. The first thing your child will need to do will be to log in to the Chromebook. To log in, you'll see two parts once they open the Chromebook. First, they need to put in their username. Their username is their district email account, which is their student ID number at student.salinasuhsd.org. Then they're going to, if they are brand new, put in a temporary password, SUHSD12345. If they are a returning student, then they'll use the same password that they created last year. Now that they have logged into the computer, you want to make sure that they are connected to Wi-Fi. So you're going to click down in the bottom corner on the Wi-Fi icon to see. If they are not connected to Wi-Fi, then you're going to click on the Wi-Fi button and connect to your home Wi-Fi or your district hotspot. As soon as a student connects to Wi-Fi, then the student district portal will open. This is where the student will see links to many things such as student view to check their grades and many of the programs that they will use in the district. Now that they're on the student portal, they will go up to the top where you see the little plus sign. They're going to click on this plus sign to open a new page in Google Chrome. Then they will have this page open in Google Chrome. Once this page is open, look for the grid, we like to call it sometimes a little waffle, on the right corner of their screen. The student needs to click on that waffle and then there they will see an icon for Google Classroom. Google Classroom is where distance learning will take place. Students will go to their Google Classroom and in their Google Classroom, they will see their classes with all the information from their teacher. They will go on the Monday to their period one class right at the start of the bell schedule time. When they select their period one class, the teacher will have directions on where the student needs to go in order to log in and start live instruction. So they will go to each of their classes that are located in Google Classroom and follow the teacher's directions to meet their teacher and to meet the rest of their classmates. Now you are set to start distance learning. We look forward to seeing you in middle school this year.